Hi guys, today we are making a easy and healthy dinner. We're making the salmon pinwheels from Trader Joe's along with some sauteed mushrooms and asparagus. And we will also be making roasted potatoes. First, we're going to go ahead and take our red potatoes and we're going to dice them into quarter inch cubes. Next, we're going to go ahead and take our baking tray. Cover that with foil for easier cleanup. We're going to coat the bottom with spray and spread the potatoes evenly. Spray the top of the potatoes with olive oil. And we're going to season that with salt and pepper. Sorry about the focus. I'm still working on that. I promise the next video will be better. Next, we're going to go ahead and take some lorries and we're going to season our potatoes with that as well. And just make sure not to season it too much because it has salt as well, so you don't want your potatoes to come off too salty. Then we're going to go ahead, mix it all up together, make sure they're all evenly coated. Then we're going to toss the potatoes into the oven on the top rack at 425 degrees for 25 minutes. Next, for our pinwheels, we're going to go ahead and coat the bottom again. Take each pinwheel, place it on the tray, then we're going to spray the top of the pinwheels with a little bit of olive oil and we're going to season them with salt and pepper again. Um, we're going to take those and place them on the middle rack for 18 to 20 minutes. Next, we're going to take the asparagus. I like to cut off a lot of the ends just because my husband hates it. So a little bit more than halfway down. Then for our mushrooms, super easy, we're just going to go ahead and cut all of those in half. Then we're going to take about two teaspoons of earth salad vegan butter. We're going to let that heat up a little bit. Then we're going to toss all of the mushrooms in and make sure to keep coat them evenly with butter. Next, I added my asparagus. I also sprayed it with a little bit of olive oil and seasoned all of the vegetables with salt, pepper, garlic powder and we're going to take some parsley and I like to take the parsley and put it on my palm and rub it together just so I can break it down into a powder. I'm missing the label on my parsley. Next, we're just going to go ahead and mix all of that up, and we're going to let it cook for about 15 minutes on medium-high heat. Then I take my potatoes out about halfway through, and I like to use a spatula to mix them all up just so I don't rip the skin off, and place it back in the oven to finish cooking. There we have our dinner guys, super healthy and delicious. Go ahead and serve it with a slice of lemon. I'll leave instructions in the description box. Thanks for watching.